They're on the crawl right now by the thousands across southern Vancouver Island. Creepy, crawly caterpillars. They're orange and black and they're fuzzy. And they have their eyes on your prized fruit trees. The tent caterpillar infestation this year is particularly bad in Saanich. So what can you do? Here's A News reporter Louise Hartland. There's a big one up here. And if you kind of look in here, there's another one over here. Byron Laux is seeing orange and black. The problem is, is they're everywhere. The fruit trees in his backyard are a breeding ground for tent caterpillars, with more nests than he's ever seen before. Um, you know, there was probably three or four last year on each of the trees. Now there's, you know, 10 or 12 on each of the trees, and they're much larger as well. And with each tent comes more damage. All the leaves below it are dead. All the leaves below this one over here are dead as well. Byron wants them gone, but he doesn't want to use any chemicals to get rid of the caterpillars. And I worry about my kids and the neighbor's kids and pets, and so I, I'm at a loss as to what to do. And he's not alone. Right now, it, it's probably the number one call that, that, that citizens have. The phones are ringing non-stop at Saanich Parks, with people wondering how to control their caterpillar invasion. We simply encourage people to either uh, just by hand remove the, uh, the nest from the trees or clip the end of that branch off and put it in a bag, put it in the shade, and then dispose of it. There's no way to prevent caterpillars from calling your trees home, but many people turn to illegal natural pesticide spray called BTK to kill them. BTK is a bacteria that's found naturally in soil. Once a caterpillar eats it, its stomach becomes paralyzed and it dies within five days. The provincial government says the pesticide has no known toxic effects on humans or any other animal. BTK is a hot seller at Garden Works right now. That You don't have to get it directly on the caterpillar. If you get it on the tree and they eat the leaf, it'll get them. But it takes a little time and it needs more than one application. The challenge is that BTK is non-selective. So um, if, if people like butterflies, but they don't want moths, uh, they may be disappointed that they'll lose everything. Despite their numbers, the caterpillars won't be around for long. Within about a week or so, they'll start to, uh, to, to form their cocoons to turn from caterpillars into moths. Good news for homeowners and trees alike. In Saanich, Louise Hartland, A News. By the way, gypsy moths are another common pest in BC that target your trees, and treating them is a very contentious issue. The forest ministry says there are no gypsy moth sprays scheduled on the island this year. Right now on the lower mainland, part of Richmond and the Harrison Hot Springs area are being sprayed from the air for gypsy moth.